Hi everyone, welcome back to Europe and Resource 4, The Greatest Empire. Um, and as we did last time, we are doing the same right now. We are simply waiting for some Diplo points to trickle in so that we can get our colonial range up. And it might be, seem a bit reactive on me to not just sit around doing nothing. And I'm going to wait on this until our um, pools uh, top up here because th there are some... Um, some areas that are just a couple of months away from uh, spreading the institution. But yeah, um, there aren't really much we could do. I think at this point we could take Scotland on. The only thing is that when we do, um, France is going to join against me and that's going to be an issue. And as you just saw, I'm going to show it soon, and France will join. Um, they have rivaled us, so we should keep that in mind. This is going to be great, uh, grant new world charter, grant new world charter. It's going to be great uh, as soon as we start colonizing, but as it's not, and this is going to be great as well. Um, right, what was I thinking? Uh, right, we, we need to cancel our mission because we have lost the claim against Scotland anyway. Right, and that's that. How far we are one tick away from getting uh, this, so let's get that first. Okay, what kind of rebels? They're pretender, so we don't really need to bother, I think. I mean, we will lose... Sorry. Uh, yeah, we will lose um, having the same heir on the throne. So for that reason alone, it might be worth uh, intervening. So you know what? Fuck it. Let's, uh, let's go. I guess... Uh, let's go to cow. And, alright, so where should we explore first? I was talking about West Africa last time, so let's uh, let's do that. North Africa is important for England, but not that important. Another explorer, do we have the space? We do not, but we could get it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it. Because you are gonna get fired. And as soon as we can, we're gonna split that fleet so we get another exploration fleet going. Sorry Humphrey, you were quite great, but uh, Cristobal Colon is um, great as well, so... Let's see if we get any opinion boost from uh, Normandy for doing this. Yeah, we did. Nice! Okay, uh, let's get back to London. Let's lower these again. I forgot about splitting the fleet, but I'm gonna do it as soon as, well, now, as soon as they're done. Right, there we go. Uh, we need another parliamentary seat. Right, we enacted this issue already. Cool, we won that debate. Um, let's give um, Cork one, why not? Alright, <clears throat> I talked about this last time. We should give it to uh, those with the highest highest development. Um, Essex has one, Yorkshire, Oxfordshire, Gloucestershire. Gloucestershire. I'm uh, working on my British English. Uh, where's Gloucestershire? Gloucestershire. Lost just whatever. Um, are we close to getting anything here? We are. N well, we are gonna embrace Renaissance soon, so we will get it then. Uh, large city. I'm gonna not. I'm not gonna bother with. And um, discover America. We're gonna get that really soon. So uh, unfortunately, I don't think we're gonna be able to, as you can see, humiliate the rival. Our rivals are simply too strong moment. Yep, sounds good. Right, so one of our uh, explorers are done, so let's um, get that coast ready so that we can start 
colonizing. Oh, great. Uh, and we can't reach it. Great. So, this might seem a bit rash, but I'm gonna fire this guy because it... That's why we need to do that. Alright, then I know. Need another seat in Parliament. France has taken some um, provinces from Spain. That is never good. That almost always means they are gonna expand quite a bit. Cumbria, sure. Do you want a bit low in development, maybe? Lancashire has one. Glamorganshire? Glamorganshire? Let's go, sure. By the way, culture-wise, except that it's Gascon, Norman, and English. Unfortunately, Irish, Welsh, Flemish, and Basque isn't uh, accepted. So I suppose we should uh, promote Irish as soon as we can, and then also uh, Scottish when we get over there. Um, right, we were... Oh, no debate. Well, okay. Then we have uh, more seats than we need, but that's fine, I guess. This this one is nice. Um, our sailors are fine, as you can see. So I think I'm going to go with the uh, quartering of troops. The land attrition one. Probably the mo most important. And uh, most useful, at least, at the moment. Okay, so use crown lands would mean lose legitimacy. We can lose one, that's fine. Uh, Lancashire is gonna have to wait. Navy tradition, no worries. Dip support we're gonna keep. That one we're gonna keep as well. More Navy commission, no problem. So 85% seems decent. Any chance at a colonial guy? Thank you. Thank you very much. We still can't reach this, I think. So that's just awful. Um, we can reclaim Armagnier, Armagnier uh, or simply do that, which we are doing anyway. It's uh, very quickly gone from doing nothing and just waiting for our ideas to come in to now doing a whole lot all of the time. So let's um, try to keep up on it. Let's explore as much as we can, and I was thinking of doing this, but before we do that, I do wanna... Because this is gonna be another two years, another one year, uh, before we can do it, so... Let's uh, develop some. I usually prioritize getting them up to an equal number of 10, so... Because then you unlock more building slots, so um, if you're... If you're finding uh, someone with this one had not, Cornwall had nine development, for example, so while it would be, would have been cheaper to um, develop Lincolnshire, uh, it's better to uh, develop Cornwall because then you unlock a further building slot, as you can see um, here, right here. This one was uh, locked last time, so um, before I developed, so that's why. If you wanted to know the inner workings, um, and by that reasoning, we should. Uh, and develop Essex some because it was at 19, so that's good. Um, I'm thinking of maybe going to London if I can find it. No London. Why isn't London in here? Where am I missing it? Is it called London? It is called London, so why? Okay, whatever. Um, and here's the idea we could improve it so that. Uh, we get uh, this bonus here, but I don't think it's worth it, honestly. So let's uh, keep that on back burner and go for Yorkshire, sure. That should be enough for now. And as you can see, we are... I was gonna say we are um, ever climbing up here, but we aren't because we are still behind on tech. Right, now I'm just going to check 
how this is going. Any anyone close? I guess Gloucestershire is quite close, and also um, a bit in here in the north, but nothing else. So let's uh, let's um, embrace it now and wait another year, and then do this. Gonna take the autonomy. Because in the end, autonomy is simply manpower and money, and we do have enough of both of those. So, well, we are getting our manpower back, but it's not that important. Uh, let's just keep exploring everything that isn't yet, and then go for coast last. I suppose we should do coast over here just to uh, start our colonization. We lost an advisor, hopefully not a colonial one. Nope, we didn't. Cool. Manpower, perfect. Let's keep going on that line. King is bank. King. France is bank bankrolling everyone, it seems. No idea where they're getting their money from. Okay, so can we do anything with the clergy? We cannot as of yet. Can we colonize? We cannot. It's quite a bit away still. So that's quite unfortunate. And we can't do this either. So, okay, um, either we go head first into the, this idea group and finishes it, finish it, or we try to uh, get this one soon. It's going to give us another 115 range, and that will be enough, I think, to get us over to Arquin, um, if Tarquin is alright with that. But, um, I don't know, let's, uh, let's wait and see. As it is, I'm gonna keep keep exploring here. And on points, we are actually fourth, which is uh, impressive, I think. So now we actually have enough men to fully reinforce, but not enough to really fight in a protracted war yet. By the way, I'll be thinking about this. We want to see some um, mayu. And taxes, I think it's um, pronounced uh, there. It's a um, full conversion mode of um, European Resorts 4. Then uh, write in the comments or um, give me a thumbs up on this video, and uh, hopefully, I'll understand what that means. Right, and for those of you who don't know what this means, it, this is um, when you've gotten 800 points, which is enough to adopt one of these things, you can start a golden area. You can do it once throughout the whole game in any era. And it gives you all of these bonuses, which it I usually do it um, if I'm playing on the European mainland during the, um, the Thirty Years' War or the, the Holy War between uh, the Catholics and the Protestants. Simply give me that edge that I usually need. Uh, usually need, but um, suppose I'm not really sure when we're going to use it here in England with England, possibly during some kind of um, revolutionary war, um, like if Independence War. I mean. Or if we fight, fight in France or anyone like that. Yeah, we're gonna do this because stability is always nice. And I'm thinking here. Um, right now this costs 514. And everyone we, we do is gonna lower it by another 2, I guess. I think. Can we see that? Yep, every, every idea lowers it by 2%. And we're, it's going to get lower over time as well. Um, so in the long term we are going to save more people points by simply waiting. And if this costs 500, next it's going to cost at least 600. So that's 1,100 points. That's quite a lot of time. I suppose wait and build up. I'm going to go with the, the idea group first. And wait it out, getting... Uh, the, the economic base we um, the best economic base we can so, so that we can bankroll the colonies when we want them when we start colonizing so that we can uh, probably have three colon colonists going at once okay so um, marketplaces I already built some do we want to build some more uh, maybe in the pale to get that uh, extra boost in the North Sea Although uh, Northumberland would be better for that, so let's go with Northumberland, I guess. Can I build 
I cannot build uh, workshops yet, so I'm gonna do that eventually. Suppose that's the next admin tech. Let's send them both away. Why not? Hopefully it's, it'll go faster. Um, so let's see what we um, we've discovered so far. We've discovered some of uh, Brazil and I, this is Caracas, I think. So um, Colombia and uh, Venezuela, Venezuela and um, Car the Caribbean with all the small islands. And uh, this is uh, Haiti and Dominican Republic and so on. And this is guana and, and stuff as well, but they're so small, so I don't really notice as such. And this was a re what I really love about a colonial game. You get a lot of free uh, from events uh, points. You either gain an explorer, uh, which we already have two of, so don't really need it. Uh, or we get admin points, which is great. And... I don't really know about this one. I think I'm going to go with simply arranging them. I don't think we're going to be down here in a long time. Now, what we could do is... We can't do it yet. But as soon as we've done with the D group, we can conquer like Rio Grande or uh, Pernambuco or whatever. And then use it as, as a base of expansion, which would be great. So it would be, it would be easier for us to colonize. So that might be what I do um, when, it, when our idea group is finished. March. So let's uh, yeah, let's do this. We are almost full on uh, military points anyway. Anything else? Um, we can get quite a lot of taxes by placing a courthouse in. I think it's a courthouse, a church in uh, London. So I think we're gonna do that and next in Yorkshire and um, Oxfordshire, Oxfordshire, whatever. So I'm going to do that because, as I said, I want to build up that strong uh, economic base for for the colonies when we are going to start with that. Workshop, yep, let's go. The earlier the better. And then let's see. And this is great. More tax, better missionary strength and also um, reform desire. Yes, perfect. Exactly what we're looking for. We already have four car cardinals. I did not know that. Okay, so we are being dragged into a war here by uh, Austria or a strike um, against El Elsass, Württemberg, and uh, Nuremberg. Nuremberg. And of course, we're gonna accept. I don't really see a situation when they are when they would manage to come over to us. So. Let's simply be that annoying uh, ally that the allies are going to be to us uh, for all of history in this game here. So we can construct a great fleet. Uh, how is our manpower looking for fleet? We can have another four and we already have seven. So we would need 13 more. We could do that. Um, I don't think it's worth it though. So let's... Let's do this, I guess. Import, improve uh, relations with uh, Scotland. I am. Um, I'm sure uh, Cameron is going to be overjoyed that even though they've left the EU now, his um, great great um, ancestors are ruling Scotland. So I suppose Scotland won't be leaving anytime soon. Um, but I don't know. Okay, so. Uh, just as before, we are simply waiting for stuff to happen, essentially. We don't have to have our fleet waiting in uh, port. It's not like we um, have many enemies with, uh, with a large fleet at the moment. Okay, so let's see how much money we can make from workshops. Any good... Um... I'm just going to look it over here, see if there's anything that's especially worth developing. Not really. Any... Um... And the trade goods that we really want. I mean, we got some grapes, but I think France is going to rule us on grapes anyway. We could focus on cloth, I guess. And this is the boring me coming up. We're going to look at strategic goods, cloth, production leader, the Ottomans. 
and we are only about percent and a half behind. We and we probably could get the trading bonus as well if we got the um, production leader bonus. Um. I'm just going to take a look here if we can find one of these. Alright. Um, you know what, let's uh, consider it for the future. No reason to uh, jump head in like that. And we will get nothing because we we get, we get two ducats because we joined, I guess. Not, we, not, not that we did anything, but still. Anyway, uh, with the conclusion of that word that we didn't participate in, uh, let's end the episode here. So, if you like the series, please leave a like or a dislike if you dislike it. And consider subscribing if you want to see more. I really appreciate it and it helps out a lot. And yeah, that's it. Have a good night and uh, let's see you tomorrow. Bye.